you're going to be a speaker, you need to have the belief system that what you say matters, okay. and people want to hear what you say, and that you may not be good yet, but you're getting there. I mean, you have to have a belief system that's empowering, Makes sense. and then you have to know how to do it, right? You just, people say, I want to share my message. Well, if you don't know how to share your message, people aren't going to hear your message. So you have to have the fundamentals to communicate with people. So believe it. You have to be believe to it first. Understand it second. You have to believe it first, and then you have to learn the fundamentals from somebody who's going to teach them for you. And that's the value of today's world with social media and internet. You literally can Google how to pick up women, or how to be a great speaker, or how to put it, you know put in some plumbing, and you're going yeah. to find somebody. A mil so million. you get to go through people, find out who's talking to you, who's speaking to you, and you've got to learn from them. Writing. <clears throat> you've written the, a couple of these books. I have. It's, Part of the Culture Matters vision is actually live in a world where every man, woman, and child takes responsibility to read, write, and speak every day. Right. I love you for that. Thank you. You've written <laughs> books. You've done things. What, what was that process like sitting down and doing what no one wants to do, which is actually write their thoughts? Down. Yeah, yeah. That's very challenging. And, and uh, Dennis Waitley told me a great story that you'll appreciate. He said, you know, when I decided I want to write my first book. And then... The next year came around and people said, hey, how's that book going? Uh -huh. And he realized I was in love with the concept of writing a book, but actually doing it was something different. And I think you find that all, everybody wants to write a book, but doing it something different. So what I did is like I do anything, I break it down, I reverse engineer it, okay. put the fundamentals together, and I said, every, I look at my calendar, my travel schedule, and I say, boom, boom, I said, well, here's where I've got an hour, here's where I've got two hours, I'm gonna write Every day I, I blocked it. I put it in the calendar. So literally I would write Act on those it. days. I would just write on those days okay. and string it together. So I created consistency and created a success habit that when I wrote, I was going to write for X amount of time. And I just kept doing it. And so over the course of time, whether it was one month, two months, or three months, yeah. I created my, my manuscript or my book. But it takes a certain type of brain and character it to does. do that. I'm thinking it, like you're in school, right? I had a 1.9, I should have showed up maybe and done something. <laughs> Your brain works. Are you say more of an orderly person, a chaotic person, where you're least favorite class, best favorite class kind of guy? Yeah, where, I mean, where are we at? I, was a, I was a good student, but I wasn't, I only went to school because I wanted to play basketball. I went to college to play basketball. Huh. So I so just. that was your anchor in a way. That's all I knew. <clears throat> that's all I knew. 